Yo, hello everyone! Explore the world of dropshipping in 2023 by connecting dropship.io to your Shopify store. The step-by-step -step tutorial will guide you through the integration process, opening doors to a wider range of products and suppliers. So, let's get started. Before we start with this video, make sure to watch it from now till the end so you have the full information. So, first of all guys, which is the obvious thing is to open your Shopify store. By heading up to Shopify and then clicking on the login button right here, you will be able to join your account and choose what store you want to work on. So as you can see, now I am on my store. The second thing, which is obviously hidden to dropshop.io, as you can see, this is the link. And once you open the website, you will find that it is available on Shopify, Amazon, eBay, Wix, WooCommerce, and BigCommerce. So that means it will be working. You can integrate these two apps together. So let's start by starting a free trial. Just like that, I'm going to choose my Google account and choose my first email so I can look into my account. And there I am inside of my account in a second. So just give it a minute and there you go. So now they will give you two options. Either you want the basic, the standard and the premium. So you have to go for one of these plans. You can try them for free for the first seven days, but otherwise you will not be able to get into your account. But for now, let's keep it and let's keep it simple. Now, the same thing goes for Shopify. Make sure to go to your apps and from apps, click on all recommended apps and make sure to find if you uh, make sure to see if you could find the app uh, dropship.io uh, drop on your uh, in your app store so there we go and as you can see it doesn't really exist over here so what should we do in that case i mean there's no dropshop.io um there's nothing specifically about it so what should we do now this is the solution that i'm going to show you guys um the first thing is by going in dropshop.io in case you had the subscription you will be able to actually see the integration through dropship.io so if you want to drop ship io integration with shopify you'll find a whole article in the help center of them. So guys, as I said, as you can see in front of you, this whole page will explain the whole integration. So first of all, there is two methods or more, or there's four ways actually. So the first method, which is by going to the upper left corner, click on your username, as you can see, and then by doing so, you will reveal a small panel that you can use to manage your, your account. Set the app theme to connect to your store simply by clicking on plus connect Shopify store, as you can see in the screenshot right in front of you. And then an image will pop up and you should just in it put your Shopify link and the Shopify code is going to be this one as you can see here I have admin.shopify slash store slash this code and this is the code that you need to be aware of and put it inside of the link and just like that you will have your uh, Shopify store connected with drop ship.io the second method is by going to product database and then click on three points on any kind of product that you have there and then click on import product to shopify and just like that you will be able to import the product to shopify and the same thing just put your uh, store again the same process which is connect to new store and then choose it to be as shopify and just like that you can connect it so for the third method which is through the sales tracker the same thing will be happening over and over you just have to click on the three point settings and then import product to shopify and you will go through the same process once more and the fourth method, which is by going inside of the competitor resource, the list of products will appear and next to each one of them and you will find like the far right, you see the import product button. Click on it and it will show you the pop-up screen that you can use to import to Shopify. As you can see, click on connect to new store, add your store and then connect into it and then import it. So guys, the missing process, which is once you click on connect, they will actually redirect you to your Shopify store and there you will have to install the app of 
ship.io since you can't really install it through the app store so you will have to install it through that way and then you will be able to import anything that you have on dropship.io to your shopify store and in case you didn't manage to actually do any of that well i have a fifth solution for you and there it is guys the second app that will help us to integrate both shopify with dropship.io so the first thing is by going to zapier.com <coughs> which is this website in front of you as you can see just copy this link go and paste it on your browser the second thing which is going to the apps you will find it on the side menu click on apps and simply now you will find obviously shopify as an app so here it is next thing to do is connect and make sure to connect it with one of your stores as you will see right here so let's give it some time simply here just copy the code of your store and then you will be able to connect it it is very easy guys process so you can continue to shopify and there you have it now after i have done that just click on here just the connection if it is working uh, sometimes if it is not working it will show you nothing like this one like that one and like this one right over here so if it is working it will tell you that the connection has been tested successfully so now for the second app which is dropship.io how can you find it the same thing go to app and search for apps here dropship and let's find it here so now this is the problem that dropship.io doesn't really have any kind of uh, affiliate program or like partnership with uh, with this app which is up here so what should we do now so it's very easy guys but it will cost you money still so I'd rather actually go and buy a subscription on dropship than getting it that way that I'm going to show you now so the first thing is by going to the upgrade plan section and as you can see you will have to upgrade your plan obviously so you have to go for the professional plan which will cost you more than 50 dollars in case you went for a professional plan per year in case you want per month it will cost you around 73 dollars as you can see here it's going to be around 73.5 74 72 so around this case and now here what you are aiming for is this unlimited premium apps and the custom logic with path these two things or features are going to help you to get a custom app just for your account made by the support so once you upgrade your plan uh, you just have to go and contact the support tell them that I want to add dropship.io as a custom app with its logic path and as a premium app and they will accept your offer they will give it to you in less than three days so this is how you can do that through Zapier but yeah again the price is not really helping if you want directly to dropship and you got a premium plan that would be so much better for you than getting something like 50 dollars this will help you a lot specifically with the amount of money that you will get and still anyway if you bought this professional plan you will still have to create an account on dropship and conduct into it which is still a bad thing since you will have to buy an account again and get it for a premium or a standard or a basic plan so this is why going through the dropship and getting a plan is very helpful than doing any third party app as your helper to connect shopify with dropship io and yeah guys that was it for today's video thanks a lot for watching and see you guys in the next tutorial